Well, we knew coming in that uh, any game you play was going to be a war and playing on one or two possession games, you got to operate late. And I thought our guys really did a great job uh, operating down the stretch and uh, having a, a senior point guard and a, a senior like Royce O'Neal leading us. Um, then you have uh, two juniors, Rico and uh, TP, that uh, really did a good job keeping everyone focused and uh, making sure we operated uh, properly down the stretch. And credit our guys for uh, uh, grabbing rebounds and not letting them get second and third opportunities down the stretch and contesting threes because they, they sure made a ton early on. Okay, thank you, Coach. Let's go to questions for our student athletes and we'll come back to Coach Drew in just a bit. First question, guys, will be on your left. Chuck Carlton, Dallas Morning News for Pretoria. Talk about that play where it looked like you had the breakaway, kind of lost the handle on it, and it looked like you were going out of bounds and then fouled Rico for the dunk. Oh, uh, yeah, I just lost the ball. Um, Got to be, gotta be ball strong with it. Um, but uh, as I was going out of bounds, I whipped my head around. I just saw Rico coming down the middle and shot it to him. He made a great play. It's hard to miss that big body. <laughs> John Hardaway, with Travis Alspertari. Uh, you guys uh, really seem to pick up the defense in the second half, got some big steals. What were y'all doing? Were y'all just being more aggressive, or what was going on? Uh, we, got, we got a little bit more focused than we were for the first 10 minutes of the game. Uh, flew around a lot more, closed out, and um, went inside and rebounded the ball, just active with our hands and got fast breaks. Um, credit to Lester, Royce, and Kenny. They did a good job of operating fast breaks towards the end of the stretch. Uh, we came out with the win. Stay on the right. Jerry Hill, Bayo-Berry, Insider Royce. T Coach talked about it, but y'all's poised down the stretch. It's a yeah. one possession game in the last five minutes. Talk about what y'all were able to do here. They, um, pretty much starts with me and Kenny being seniors. Uh, and then with the help of TP and Rico being juniors, uh, we just had to keep everybody poised. And then Ish stepped up off the bench, uh, especially when we got in trip out of trouble. Uh, so you never know who's going to step up. But we just have to stay together as a team. Other questions for Royce or Tori? Okay. We'll move to the left. Royce, I believe the last count was you had 12 baskets in the second half. Ten of those were assisted baskets. What does it say about this team, not only in this game, but I guess throughout the season? I mean, we're all unselfish guys, really. We, uh, we love playing with each other because we always going to find an open person. I mean, our main goal is to get to the paint, penetrate, find an open person for an open shot. You might have a good shot, but somebody else might have a better one. Mr. Torian, um, you, you guys, uh, you, you all beaten West Virginia pretty handily the first two times. This was a much more competitive game. Is that what you all expected? Yeah, most definitely. We expect that in every game we play. Um, but the first two times it was it was pretty. It was a, it, those were tough games too. We just kind of caught a, a run at the end, the very end. So they're a very tough team. They played very hard. Tough team to uh, out rebound. Uh, but we we did what we needed to do tonight. And we came out with the win. Other questions? Okay, hang on the line. For both student athletes, beginning with Royce, I was just curious. No, you guys are just probably in the moment and all this, but in the back of your mind, are you aware that, hey, you might have a chance to be playing your way into four seed, three seed, maybe a chance to be in the Houston regional going forward, things like that, that might factor into it if you have a big tournament? Yeah, right now we just focus on the Big 12 tournament, taking it one game at a time. After the tournament, we look forward to it. Same what you said, just um, focusing on what team we have next. Can't look, to, can't look forward to that. Good teams in the Big 12, and we got to um, prepare for them right now and not think about the future. Okay, is that it for the student athletes? Okay, we'll let you guys return to the locker room with uh, SID Nick Jones and uh, basketball SID David K.